this is a video to explain how to set up an iLink SIP phone T30P. So the first thing that you need to do is to find out the IP address of the phone. For that, you need to, to press on the button on the center of the keypad and the IP address will appear. In my case, is this one and you need to put it in your browser. The credentials are needed, so you can use the default pass, the default, that is admin, admin. So you are accessing the configuration side for your phone. Um, after that, you can, you can configure more things in network. In my case, I will need to configure also the DNS, but probably in other situations, just with DHCP, everything was will be uh, configured. So no more actions are needed to have connectivity. The next step, again, if the DHCP don't get uh, time, you need to do more things here, although in my case, uh, DSCP is enabled, but I need to choose the, the time zone and, and location. And you also can choose N NTP servers. After that, you go again to settings and go to auto provision, and you need to add the server URL for the provision. For that, uh, you need to, to choose one of, of the URLs provided by Microsoft. Um, I'm going to choose the first one, Europe, uh, and paste here. So I think I forgot to say at the beginning of the, the video that this is to configure the iLink T30P in, with Microsoft Teams. So after that, I will just press auto provision. And I'm not going to do it here because uh, I, I'm not interested on auto provision this phone now. But in your case, if you are you want to complete the process, just click on this button. The phone will be rebooted and the user will be will see uh, the option of signing in the phone. And, the, and if Pressing the sign in, uh, the user will see a URL link and a code. So the user just needs to access to that link on on his or her computer and log in, uh, well, ent enter the code, and then enter the Microsoft 365 credentials. And after that, uh, the the phone will be enrolled in Microsoft Teams.